So let's review the project scope for this chapter. We're gonna develop a project called My Weekly Budget App. So let's review the features. Uh, the user can add a budget for the week. Then we're gonna add expenses into the list and we're gonna track how much we are spending and the remaining budget. Once we spend 50% of the budget, we're gonna print the remaining budget with a yellow color. Once we spend 75%, print the remaining budget with a red color. So let's review the project. This is going to be the project. Yeah, you can see when we open this, it will ask what is the budget for this week. If you click here on cancel, uh, you can see this is going to reload, asking uh, again. So we need to add a valid budget. If you add OK here, it's going to ask again. If you add a zero right here, it's going to ask again. So we need to add a valid budget right here. I'm going to add 500 for this week. And you can see that we have budget right here and we have left 500. So once we start adding expenses, this is going to be updated. So let's say that we are going to add transportation and we're going to add $200. We're going to click here on add and you can see we have added right here. We have transportation and we have $200. The remaining was updated and I, now we have only $300 left. If you try to submit the form empty, it's going to print this error. There was an error, all fields are mandatory. So if you remember, I say that once we spend, 50% of the budget, this is going to print in a different color. So we're going to add food and we're going to add $100. Add, and now you can see we have transportation and food and the remaining budget is print in a yellow color. So let's add another one. Let's say that we add a book and let's say that we add $100 again. Click here on add and now you can see we have three different items into the expenses list. And here on the bottom, we have uh, the remaining budget. Since we already spent more of the 75% of the budget, this is going to be printed in red. So we can continue adding more and more and more stuff. So we're going to add something like internet and we're going to uh, spend $100. We're going to click here on add and now you can see the budget. You can continue adding more if you want. So this is going to be a way that you can track your budget. So if you add something like dinner, and you add 50, click here on add, and now you can see that you pass the budget. A really nice project where we are going to practice everything that we have learned so far in this course. So let's continue working in the next video.